Oh, hi. So this one will probably be a short episode. I'm pretty tired. I just wanted to take a poke around this particular dungeon before uh, heading to bed. Also, I just realized I can turn right. Interesting. I'm going to keep going up right now. The, uh... Drunk and drunk born will probably have to be not a whole bottle of wine in the future because holy cow. And hangovers aren't fun. Especially when you have to work on Monday. So it looks like there's a little passage place here. I wonder if. So I still don't know if this game has the hidden passages that Dark Souls had. Okay, he has glowy eyes because I think he has my souls. I'm trying to climb up he usually falls. So I do really like the lead-in. Wow, wow, they hurt. He has a weapon. That, that's nice. Yeah. These guys remind me of the giants from Dark Souls, just the of peach little spaces. Or maybe I just not what the pieces are yet. Oh, no, no, they're human. Just Definitely a debuff on me. Oh, I wonder if it's oil, like um, that guy up there was throwing Molotovs. One sec. Hmm. Don't know. How right, about we go down? Something died apparently. Okay, you're the one with the grab of oh, scariness. Oh fuck, you still have a big scary grab. just two shot me. He, he barely got me with the backhand and then apparently the dungeon is painful and I've still got to get better at uh, comboing into my hammer or just kind of get used to doing it. 
Okay, so there's a gate up there, so I guess I can't really go that way. Right here. So one thing I'm not certain about is if I leave here, like if I just decide to go hop into the bonfire, can I like come back at will or do I have to pay, like is there an item, like do I have to pay the thousand souls again every time? That does way less damage than I would expect if we drop that. And I still don't have many blood vials, I should go farm that shit out. transition that's just really slow okay let's go deal with grapple pit McGee that just ruined me she has like this whole and like brutal melee hi dude Oh, that's right, there's axes up above, that's right. You don't give me fucks, do you? not fucking worth it. Well, gotta figure out how to deal with him better, because... He is dangerous. So I could try to cross that. Really hoping it would all get knocked off. like mostly intended for if you fall like an idiot and to work your way back up not to explore but who knows what's up rat oh come on that's interesting Hello, rat bros. I kind of would like it if I could, uh, dump a coin on the ground, and they would go for it and it's kind of... I keep using my gun when I just need to keep swinging my hammer. I don't think I'm going to hurt. Jesus. That kind of freaked me out that the rat was moving. There's a, a 
a carriage or something large? Because you know, lots of bodies, liquid. Man, if something gets, climbs out of the water and gets me, I'm gonna freak out. It's not gonna be good. And I'm kinda like psyching myself up for something coming out of the water. Good. Okay, so I guess you, this is intended to explore because there doesn't appear to be another way in or out. It's more of a sludge. Guessing it's still to catch me on fire. Hi, bros. Yeah. Oh, fuck. I forgot about that. Yep. Yep. Oh, come on, really? Fuck you and your stupid knife plot. Um, I guess I can shoot him. Actually, oop, oop, there we go. Apparently, I have a weak arm. Tough on resources. I don't. I don't think this is worth it so far. I mean, if I wasn't sucking, maybe it'd be worth it. Even with the free little thirty-two gubs, not worth it. Now, if there's like infinite spawning, and I can just sit here and I forgot to roll through this, um, and I could get all sorts of just souls, either sitting overnight or whatnot. Into the sauce of dudes. Okay, they're patrolling. They got fiery swords. Probably can't lure them out here. What is still. Jeez. There's a lot of shit that's getting murdered. I mean, okay. I'm pretty worried about this guy. He looks dangerous. Those are cool chandeliers. What is... I don't... Alright. 
Ding ding. That is eerie and fucking cool. That's kind of creepy. Um. Hi. Oh no, you're the dangerous one. You got like dual wielding nonsense. Oh, I'm in it. I'm in it. I can't dodge. I can't dodge. Dumb it. Idiot. I still don't know where all this shit's dying. Also, I don't know what he is. Like, that dude up there looks dangerous. I don't know if I can engage Bellboy here without getting... Alright, we're gonna try to sneak up past Bellboy. What? Is there somebody else throwing poison eggs at me? Oh, yep. Yeah. You fuck. Can I get Bobo to come after me? Oh, no, God! Fuck you! What? So not worth it. Get up! Mm -hmm. Motherfucker! Mmm. There's a big dude, and there's poison assholes. You work. I don't know if I should have actually killed that person. Like, they're targetable. Yeah, it's the icon for using the, the thing. The rune thingy that gets you to teleport back with your souls. Um, it's kind of a cool mob. I still don't know quite. Fuck you, dude. Nope, nope, no, 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 no. I wanted to do this one. Now come get me? Maybe? Hi, dude. Oh, there's poison fucker. Can I lure you down at least? Good. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Jeez! Unexpected. That was unwise of me. I can't stagger him. And nope. Wow. Nope. Wow. All right. And dog rolling is not working out how I want. Not a matter of resources. Wow. I wanna go home. I'm gonna, just, I'm gonna end up losing all my souls in here. That's, that's what's gonna happen. Okay, that looks like a significant lever. Interesting. I still don't know what was giving me all this. Like, I assume maybe pulling the lever is going to open something up and show me where all the shit was dying. What do you do? Okay. 
I'm guessing that's back near start. The gate across the way that I couldn't use. So now I wonder if the progress is maintained. Go buy, go buy shit, supplies, and like, does this actually let me like kind of dungeon delve, or do you have to do it all in one go? These are things I don't know. So I'm guessing this is the gate that opened. Nope. Interesting. Oh, yes. It looks like one of those little doors. Is it going to show up behind me? Is there a boss, maybe? Ooh. Like, I somehow feel like this is going to go to, like, phase two of the dungeon, and I'm kind of boned if I go further. Oh, yeah. <laughs> of course. him directly? Huh. Because I don't have any... I don't have any, um... blood majiggers. Okay, so... Oh, cool. It looks like I can access the boss. Um... Oh, okay, so I guess... Okay, so that was where I came from. And then this bonfire is... Just like my checkpoint. So, I'm gonna try the boss one more time, so that now that I don't have souls, it doesn't really matter. Um, just see if I can take him at all. trying to teleport out. Eh, kind of. It will let me buy a bunch of blood vials. But is it worth one of those items? Eh, it's not really that much. Nah. I'll see if I can come back later and deal with the boss. I might try to use the hammer against him when, when he's more open. What time is it? I think I'm getting kind of tired. Okay, it's nearly 11. So, does this just let me go in? Okay, cool. Oh, but you can take the challenge, interesting. So, you know, it'll be a very compelling episode. 
get to see me die a little bit in the labyrinth. And I just forfeit those 4k souls. And I still don't know where to go. So, I mean, there's the clock tower type place at the top. There's the 10k souls to go through the church door. Um, I guess I should try talking to the doll or see if the wheelchair dude's there. We usually have some other guys. Uh, Alright, fine. Uh, I was trying to come back in the shirt. It doesn't seem to do that much damage, and it's really slow to wind up compared to the axe. I guess the light attack is not bad. I didn't do the werewolves, but I think when I was watching this thing, they weren't worth trying to pop. I don't remember. Do this loop and pop it. Kirk Hammer is definitely cool, but so far the uh, axe is definitely winning on like usability. See if this guy got run over by a boulder. <laughs> nope, he gets mauled to death. Blah, 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 blah. Yep, you're pinned in. <laughs> Wait, do you die to a boulder? Please die to a boulder. Run, run! Eh. Ooh, that guy has a cool looking sword. Your pistol shooting stuff, and you got your TK gun. <laughs> I kind of like to pretend that was a boulder. That could have been that guy. <laughs> blood vials back.
she talk to me while she's in her inanimate state? Nope. And Wheelchair McGee is missing again. Unfortunate. I feel like I had two humanity. Maybe those are in my souls. Well, I'm just mostly poor. So is there really nothing else down here? Is this like the end of a route? I mean, there's the door, which doesn't open from this side, apparently. Um, so I'd almost feel like there should be progression down here. Let's think about that the other night. Or today. exploring because if it's not the door um wait what that is some weird geometry like you can see red down there is that skybox i think that's skybox underneath the altar oh weird So where else have I dead ended? Like there was up near the chapel. There's a 10k door, presumably. Um, hmm. There is the old the route near the, the um. I already checked that gate though. I think the gate near um, the clinic. I mean, maybe I have to dungeon delve? How do I see this up to it? Like, talk to Or that dude was here. Oh, wait. No, I still don't have that. Ascend to Odin Chapel. feel like I need the 10k maybe maybe I can go across the door to the cleric beast but that didn't really no they didn't say anything like this door is sealed or anything there was just a note there that was kind of confusing hmm I thought I'd check this after I had... Oh, maybe it's only after you place the chalice? Ugh, maybe. Okay, well, found my progression now. Okay. I now am 
I'm seeing places that I don't recognize. Because we are now in fucking. Uh, what's the place past Sims Tower that you fly up to? It's all leaked out of my ears. Blood attack, physical attack, cool. Um, cool. So what what do I put this in? Festival. Oh, I'm up here. That's cool. I didn't even know there was an up here. That looks like a long fall. Wish me luck. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, well. This is where I progress. Um, oh, see, it's all here now. I don't know why... It wasn't there previously? That was bizarre. Oh, let's see. So that's how I ended up sitting down. I don't know. How, is it like... Is it like... Does it use the six axis? Wait, why is it all gone now? Oh, does it like matter which direction on the D-pad you press? do the dungeon like I don't know if I'm if I should try it now or if that's gonna just be throwing souls into the wind I don't know oh yeah guy work was mentioning that maybe to get these guys to show up maybe maybe I'm looking in the wrong spot um, but he was thinking that maybe I actually had to leave a note for them to show up so that I can give them the cosmetic items Totally possible I'm just looking in the wrong freaking spot. Uh, let's see, how do I leave a note? I would want to leave like a decent note someplace. Eh. I'll try that later. Alright. Cool. I'm gonna get some sleep. And I know where to go. Pressing on. I went back there. I feel like... 
feel like I've seen what's back there, maybe. When, like, I was convinced I was never going to play this because of not having a PlayStation. And I think I watched Jay Nordy's video or Corey's video. But, uh... Yeah, alright. But, you know, this one was super thrilling. I know. They're all going to be that way. Alright. Good night.